Hey Rocker, welcome to Metal Yoga. This is where we add the epic, brutal, badassness of metal and of heavy guitar riffs, heavy drums, and the exhilarating feeling of metal, and then adding in the mindfulness of yoga, the movement as well. So you get to experience what you love about metal, and then you get to experience yoga in a different light and in a light that makes sense for you because you love metal and you love to rock out. Today's short but awesome little sequence is going to be Fist of Metal. This is going to be with squats and I'll give you another variation. So if you find it to be a little easy, this will give you a little extra something something to make it more fierce. Are you ready? This is excellent if you feel like you have some stress you need to let go, but also just great to add into any of your pre-existing workouts and to give you a little boost of, well, exercise is good for you. Let's be frank. All right. So we're going to be doing fist of metal with squats. You're going to shout, you're going to sigh, and you're going to feel good. And of course, you get a really fucking great workout. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start with a warm up and then move into that. Now I want you just to come to stand and I want you to soften your knees. Keep your knees nice and soft and close your eyes and we're just gonna take a couple breaths together. So breathing in through the nose, close your mouth for a count of five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, five, four, three, two, one. One more, inhale, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, five, four, three, two, one. Open your eyes, how do you feel? Exactly, it's beauty for yoga. Now you're gonna come to in to stand. Actually, you're gonna turn to your right. So you're gonna turn to your right. I want you to walk your feet out a little bit wider than your shoulders. And then what you're gonna do is you're going to bend your knees and you're gonna send your hips back. I'm gonna turn away so you can see me. So you're gonna send your hips back. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna shift to one side and then shift to the other side. Shift to one side and shift to the other side. So it's like a sway from side to side. Okay, keep doing that. So shifting to the right, shifting to the left, stretching your inner thigh, while also doing what's called like a, it's like a half squat with a stretch. So you get a little movement in, kind of a workout, but also a really quick and easy way to get a just combined warm up. So you get more for the time you're spending. All right, so now we're gonna add in open up squeeze your shoulder blades together and then squeeze squeeze and you can do this in any variation any timing if you want to go to one side and hold it for a second you can if you feel like you want to do it a little bit quicker you can too all right and three two and one awesome now you're gonna come back to stand come to about the front of your mat, just a, maybe a couple of shoe lengths or feet lengths down. And now we're gonna take a squat pulse. So we're gonna squat and then I'll give you a variation to go up. So I'll show you the movement once and then we'll get into it. So you're gonna come into a squat. Feet again are gonna be about shoulder width distance. You can make it just a tiny bit wider if that feels more comfortable to you. So take your stance. And now I'm gonna show you the movement. So you're gonna squat like this. You're gonna reach your arms forward and then you're gonna make the horns. So you're gonna reach your arms forward and make the horns. And on your exhale, you're gonna say, ha! Squeeze your glutes, press firmly into your feet and make it fucking known exactly how you feel. Inhale down and exhale, ha! Now, if you need more than that, you're an avid workout person. You're like, dude, I need more. That's fine. So you're gonna come down and then your exhale, you're gonna go ha! And then you're gonna squat back down. Ha! All right, ready to do this? Okay, 
make your stance, sit bone distance, and then squat down, reach forward, make the horns, ha, ha, we're going to do 10, ha, 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 six, ha, 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 and one more, ha, now this time inhale, sit down your squat, and on your exhale you're going to sigh, ha, Inhale, reach up, come to stand, and ha. Three more. Ha. 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 Awesome. Reach back up. Bring your hands to your heart center. And then turn to face me. Do that as many more times as you feel like you need to. Again, adding this into any pre-existing workout that you already have or simply move on with the rest of your day. I recommend, of course, doing a bit of a cool down, whatever that looks like for you. Just rest and restore or just move about your day. Cooling down is always going to be the best approach, but sometimes that's life. All right. So when your breath has returned, <sighs> I hope this was an amazing experience for you and you got something from this. I am Stephanie and this is Muddle Yoga, Fist of Muddle. I look forward to seeing you in all the other videos that are going to be coming up in the next days. I'm so excited. Remember to like, subscribe, hit the bell, do all the shit to make sure that YouTube and wherever you're seeing this knows that you like to show this and other people can use this too. Share it with your friends and let them know how fucking awesome that it worked for you. And remember, you're a badass. Rock on.